going on YouTube? This video is brought to you by Pumpkin Pie Spice Date Rolls. Yum. No, just kidding. It's not brought to you by it. But those are what I'm about to eat here. They're a nice little snack. It's just dates, pecans, and pumpkin pie spice. Simple ingredients, but super tasty. Not organic, but literally that brand you can fucking find like anywhere. Like I've seen them in like convenience stores at gas stations and stuff. So uh, there's always options. Just uh, keep your eyes peeled. Uh, anyway, <clears throat> today what I wanted to talk about was a proposition that was thrown at me by a friend of mine. This particular friend is not vegan or plant-based or remotely anything close to it, but he does happen to be a very good friend of mine. And what he proposed was this. Um, he would go vegan for, well, he would go plant-based with his diet full on for a week, so seven days, if I, at the end of that week, um, ate one strip of bacon. <clears throat> uh, initially, uh, you know, like most people in my position, their thoughts were, fuck no, I'm not doing that, what are you fucking crazy? <clears throat> but, then I really thought about it, and I'm thinking, well, one strip of bacon versus him eating meat two to three times a day, so times that by seven, you're looking at like between 14 and 21 meals of meat per week versus one single strip of bacon. Now, I would rather not do any animal killing whatsoever, but it makes more logical sense to do that versus turn the bet down and, and have him continue to do what he's doing. Now, not only for the animals is it, I mean, it's not perfect for the animals, obviously, because there's still a strip of bacon involved, but it is better in the sense that there's a lot less meat being consumed, which also means that there's a lot less environmental impact, and it also means that it's going to be better for my friend's health. Now, at the end of that week, he may actually enjoy how he's feeling. He more than likely is going to be feeling better if he does it properly anyway. Um, so then he can continue forward even if he, if he wanted to. And so that might even be an added bonus. But it's, it's a weird situation that even though logically I know that the better option would be to have to sacrifice my own self in this case and, and eat the bacon and just, you know, take care of it that way. Logically, that's the best thing to do. But it still compromises my own morals. Therefore, it's, it's hard for me to, 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 you know, to say yes. Um, so I don't know. What, what is a week not long enough? Would two or three weeks, would that be better? Would that be enough to, to convince you to do it? If you were in my shoes, if somebody put that bet out at you, what, what would you do? Now, I know initially you're, you're thinking no, <clears throat> but again, you've got to think about the long-term picture. Now, a piece of bacon isn't going to kill me, but it is disgusting, and I would more than likely throw up after eating it. I might get a little bit sick, so there's that. But again, in the, in the greater scheme of things, it's, it's helping somebody that I care about's health, it's helping the planet. It's using less resources if he's eating plant-based for that entire week. And it's also helping out the animals because less animals are going to be consumed. You know, one strip of bacon versus probably like, you know, 18 meals of meat basically throughout the week. So, I don't know. Post your comments and, and questions down below. What are your thoughts on it? What would you do? I know there's other situations that I've heard of where vegans have taken on bets um, you know, 20 plus thousand dollars to eat a, a cheeseburger or whatever. I don't know if I would do that. <clears throat> but again, like you got to think of it as, well, what am I going to do with this $25,000? Am I going to go and buy a car with it? Uh, am I going to donate it to PCRM or, or PETA or what, whatever you're passionate about? So at the end of the day, is it better to eat that in order to, to help a, a righteous cause? Or do you just you know, stay out of it all together and just, you know, go about your business. So, I don't know. It's an interesting situation. I'm not saying I'm going to do it, <clears throat> but I've just, just something I've been thinking about the past few days, you know, what, what the better thing to do would be anyway. So, yeah, let me know what your thoughts are. Anyway, guys, I'm going to eat and chill out for a bit. I'll catch you guys later. Until next time, guys, take care.